All right, so this is a quick video talking about organizing your books once you have them into iBooks. Unfortunately, this is also going to be an Apple fails at allowing customization video, so enjoy. Hey there, I'm back again to answer this question. Can you organize your bookshelves by folders? Now, unfortunately, Apple does not allow you to use folders, but there are a few options, and I'll show you what those are. The first thing you can do is um, you can simply rearrange your books. Now, that's a weird glitch right there. Anyways, um, having only the three books, I can't really show you much of that, but with more books, you'll be able to organize the different shelves. But as far as now, you can just simply reorder the arrangement of your books. Now, that's in this format. All right, that's a really weird glitch. Anyways, switch back. All right, however, you do have this list mode. In the list mode, you have four options down at the bottom here, and I'll show you what those are. It's going to be your uh, titles, authors, and categories. Um, now, when I switch over to my titles here, I can show you that it does put them into um, alphabetical order. The other option that you have then is you can also search up the title of your book, and it will pull it up. Your next option is going to be to use authors and again with authors it will go alphabetically by your authors um, and you can still have the option to search up an author's name or even just the first letter to narrow it down just to all the H's if you have hundreds of books. Um, and your final option is categories but the downside to this is that the categories are what they're listed under in the bookstore so you can't actually create your own categories. Unfortunately, Apple has made it very difficult to make folders in this program. Um, so the best you can do is just organize how they are inside the program. So unfortunately, there's not really good news on that, but they do make it easy enough to search up and find books. Um, so thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you like the quick, quick feedback, and I'll catch you on my next video.